this video, I am going to show you how to use the MoGrid file, the Premiere Pro template which you have downloaded from Greenlit Studio. So, first of all, run Premiere Pro and go to Window and click on Essential Graphics. It will show, it will open the Essential Graphics panel. Here at the lower right corner, you will see a plus button. Click here and locate the MoGrid file which you have downloaded from Greenlit Studio. And then select it, click open. Now search that template here. Or you can use this search bar. Type here social. And here you can see that social media lower third pack 002 is appeared. Click and drag it to your timeline. Here you can see the lower third has been appeared on your timeline or over your footage. And now if you want to change the text, colors, anything, just click on this um, layer, timeline layer. It will show the edit options for this template. First of all, you can see that this, this upper section is called upper text. It means that these settings are for upper, upper text. In this case, Greenlit Studio. If you want to change this text, just click here and type the text that you want. Click enter. Here you can see the text has been changed. If you want to change its color according to your lower third design, you can just pick color picker and click here. You can see that your color of this text is changed or you can also click on this color and here you can choose whatever color you want but my suggestion is keep your color according to your according to the design of the logo uh, of the social media site which you are using in this case blue if you want to change the change the position you can do this from here position if you want opacity you can change it here okay then if you want to change the lower text you can do it here if you want to change its color you can do it from here if you want to change its size you can do it from here if you want to change the position you can do it from here okay now if you want to change the logo and the design of the uh, lower third just you have to do is search for the name if you want to it look like uh, YouTube then first of all keep it to zero and then keep YouTube slider bar to 100% if you want WhatsApp disable YouTube enable WhatsApp while sliding it to 100% If you want Twitter, do this. If you want Pinterest, just slide this 200. If you want LinkedIn, if you want Instagram, 
if you want Facebook if you want Behance whatever you want your choice just do this and use this mock profile I hope you like this if you like this please subscribe my youtube channel and like and share my video thank you